Welcome to El Tempo, news in English. Like this woman Gloria, another 200 families in the area of Swacha have had to spend their entire day taking water out from the houses. She said that the channel nearby has overflowed and this is not the first time it has happened since they made the pipeline and left it incomplete every time it rains they become flooded. Another woman said that the risk of infection to their children and everybody is very high. Today they are not even able to turn on their stove. They said that they must clean and wash everything in order to be able to cook and after that they can turn on the stove. The police had taken the children out from the flooded houses with the help of horses. The children could not go to school and the kindergartens, and also there was no way to keep them entertained. One woman commented that the police had just arrived and helped take out the children. Tonight there are no beds, they would have to sleep in other places. This young woman said that with the help of her relatives, she was able to put her bed on the upper side, and they have three days suffering from this situation. They said that then as no help has arrived to this place because they have been full of flood water. The water, electricity and telephone lines have all been cut off. The police informed that till now it has not confirmed the location of any community refuge and the people affected will move to houses of relatives, friends or neighbours. This sewage is causing a serious health problem and the residents of the neighbourhood expect the CAR, local environmental agency and the relief agencies to make a presence because till this moment they have just seen the help of the police. This is Ashley Oxen Covillius reporting for Tempo News.